Hi everyone, welcome to my channel, Everyday I'm Mothering. So today I thought it would be fun to do an unboxing of homeschool curriculum that I had ordered. So as you know from my channel, we use Torchlight as our main curriculum. And I have several videos out about that, a general overview one and then level specific ones. So make sure to check those out. They're in the description box down below. But when you order those, they're PDFs. So you need to print them out. And I typically order from Hard Copy HQ. So this year we're doing level two and I just got this in the mail. So I figured I would just share it with you and what it looks like. I always see a lot of questions about specifically Torchlight and the fact that it is a PDF, so you can either print it off or not, but if you print it off, people are always asking like, what's the best way to do that? There are a lot of companies out there that will do it. I mean, some people even just go to Staples or print it themselves. I have ordered from a couple. The first one literally took months to arrive. So even though, I mean, it looked okay, it was just way too long. So I've been really happy with Hard Copy HQ for the past two years. I ordered my level two stuff, I believe like two weeks ago. So it got here pretty quickly, but I do know that so many people are ordering right now that it could take a little longer. So any of these companies you use, just double check their like current time frame is for delivering. So obviously Hard Copy HQ will work with any, any curriculum that you want to get printed off. But this one specifically is Torchlight level two. It's going to have my teacher's guide and I honestly can't even remember what all I ordered. There's so many different PDFs with Torchlight, I can't remember what all I ordered separately. So let's see. I am just a little nervous because you can see here, the box like obviously got wet. So when it was outside, I picked it up and it just like automatically tore. So that was yesterday. And I'm really hoping that the stuff inside wasn't damaged. So we'll see. Okay. So let's see. So I can tell initially I'm a little disappointed. I don't remember what their packaging was like in the past, but I mean, there's no protective bubble wrap or anything on this. So especially with the fact I know there was water damage, I really wish that this would have been wrapped in bubble wrap or plastic of some sort. So let's see. So I have my level two from Torchlight, that guide. Then oh, the Becoming a Bard. So I got this one printed individually as well. Oh, there are cards stuck everywhere. Oh, it's like stuck to it. Um, and then this looks like it's one of the appendix and it was a mystery. I don't know how you say that, Patia Evans. So I decided to get this one printed off separately as well. And so it looks like all together, this was $93 to print. Then I don't, I guess that was just to protect it, but I didn't, no, oh, that's odd, okay. They got their cards. I really wish they'd been protected since, you know, it's all paper, but it doesn't, look like anything got wet that I can tell. So at least that's good. Yeah. So I'll put down below exactly like what I selected as far as how I get everything printed there. But I mean, you can see, I get it, you know, spiral bound and it has like the plastic protective cover on the front and back. Actually, Looks pretty dirty. Hmm. Actually, the back cover looks pretty dirty, but hopefully that can be cleaned off because that will bug me. It's like got a bunch of, probably can't see it. I don't know how well it'll even pick up. Yeah, I don't think you can see it on there, but it's got just a bunch of debris on the cover. But anyway, get printed in color and the paper is pretty thick weight. It's got a little bit of like the slick feel to it. So it's not just like normal printer paper. Um, but overall, it printed really well. 
and I just love having this actually printed out where I can flip through it and see it. It's much easier than me trying to look at a PDF file. And one of the things about Torchlight that I've talked about in my other videos is that the PDF and other pieces that come with it. So I pick and choose what I want to print separately and what I include in that main teacher's guide. So I had to print this the story out because it looked like something that I'd probably want to be able to hand Elena separately than the teacher's book. And anything like this, I just find it's nicer to bound than trying to put in a binder for her. And this one, she actually put, it has like a hard, thick paper in the back. So it's not just a paper. Looks like it turned out really nicely on this. I probably actually could have went double-sided on this and would have been a little bit cheaper. Looks really neat. I think Elena's really gonna like it. This is becoming a bard. This is the kind of yearly project that they usually have with Torchlight that they'll work on throughout the year. And since it'll be a workbook for her, I wanted to print it out. The pictures and the colors look really well. So all in all, I'm really happy with Hard Copy HQ again. And this Torchlight Level 2 stuff looks great. Now I will be doing a like sneak peek look at Level 2 since clearly we haven't actually went through it yet. I just wanna give you a look at everything that's included in it and the books we've gotten so far. That is coming also. So if you choose to to use Hard Copy HQ for your printing stuff, comment down below, let me know how it goes, or if there's another company that you think I should try out, let me know that too, because I print a lot of homeschool stuff. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up, and if you haven't yet, subscribe to my channel by clicking that button down below. That way you'll be notified about all my upcoming homeschool videos. Make sure to check out my homeschool playlist. There is a lot of great information there, tips, curriculum reviews, planners, all kinds of fun stuff. Bye everyone!